My name is Sandy Johnson, and I like to make small quilts and doll quilts. I originally was from Iowa, but I've lived in Minnesota for over 50 years, and I have um, a daughter that has been interested in quilting and sewing, and I've worked with her, and I have 12 grandchildren, and I started quilting when I was young with my mother and sewing all kinds of clothing. I have fond memories of staying with my aunt for a short time, and as I was packing, I just took a suitcase full of fabric and no clothing. My daughter has been helping me set up different things and working with doll quilts, and I wanted to show you a few that I have made. This one is English paper pieced with fourth inch paper pieces, hexagons, and then you sew them together after you've taken out the paper and then applique it to the background. And this one is a red and white quilt, pinwheel quilt, with a lot of interesting fabrics. And around the corner, around the edge, is the birds and um, leaves. This quilt is a blue and white that I made with um, little triangles, and this has buttons that I got from my mother's and grandmother's sewing box. You can add buttons and different things to it. Here's another little quilt like that. This one is made with shirtings, different fabrics that used for shirtings, reproductions, and this too has some antique little buttons that I added to it. You can also put a little hook on the back and hang them up if you'd like. This quilt is paper pieced on the machine and this has uh, shirtings and a variety of various reproduction fabrics and a red border. And I also put the backing on and I put a little little fabric in the back to hang it if in case you decided to. Here's another quilt, pink and brown, which is an interesting combination. And this one too is used with um, different triangles, different patterns. Lots of the patterns that you can use are coming from these magazines and you can purchase them at antique stores and all around. And there's a lot of interesting old patterns in them that you can use for uh, your blocks. This quilt is a little quilt with the center medallion is um, uh, ladies from Little Women and all the little squares of different fabrics with different fussy cut, cutting out different patterns. This quilt is a pink and green hand applique. And this is, um, you can quilt these by hand or machine if you'd like. And you can put a label on the back if you'd like. Oh, this one doesn't have it. That's not the one with the label. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay. This one has a little label on it if you'd like to put a label on the back and tell when you've got the quilt and when the date on it and who made it and what it was made for. Real quilts can be made with small amounts of fabric and using uh, clothing fabrics also. And adding embellishments can add to the details of the quilts. I hope you try making some of these doll quilts. It's interesting and fun to, to work with. Thank you.